think uh, we could first print indent. The first one is zero, so it is not going to be indented. And we're going to print the label of this tree. Uh, you could use like plus and stir function like this. Either of the solution is okay. And for children or branches in t dot branches, we're going to call print tree recursively. So we're going to print B. And indentation has to increase one or two. Okay. In this case, we incremented the indentation two. So we're going to plus two. It is very simple, right? And before we have a look at binary trees, this one is last PPP exercise. Um, this function is called count path. Uh, this tree looks like this. Um, the children of three is minus one, one, and one. The children of this node is two and three. And this one's children child is one. This one's child is two and three. So what this function does is count the number of paths that sums up to this number. When we start from three, it is already three. So there's one path that sums up to three. And another, another path is we go from this part, this part, and we reach here, it is, it is going to be three again. So we have two paths that sums up to three. And there is no path that sums up to five. And when it comes to six, there is one path. So we come, we first start from three, one, and two, and it is going to be six. There is one path that sums up to six. Uh, 